Washington hospitals say they are operating under contingency care right now. So what that means is that hospitals aren't operating normally as they struggle to keep up with an influx of COVID patients. Hospitals now across the state report that they're continuing to have to cancel important surgeries because of the record number of COVID patients filling up beds. Know that people who have debilitating and painful conditions are having to wait. Um, folks who might need back surgeries and are in serious pain, people who can't see and who need eye surgeries, people who are waiting for joint plate replacements who cannot otherwise move. These are people who are suffering unnecessarily because our hospitals are overwhelmed with COVID patients. There are currently more than 1,600 people hospitalized with COVID here in the state of Washington. That number is essentially unchanged since last week. More than 95% of those hospitalized are unvaccinated. The State Hospital Association said we are seeing a ripple effect of Idaho's crisis of care designation with patients being transported into Spokane. During this morning's briefing, hospital officials said we could be at the beginning of a plateau in cases, but we still don't know the impact of large in, uh, events, including Labor Day travel, fairs, and the return to school.